Well, have you ever been on the receiving end of an act of kindness? Well, CanTabs now have the chance to thank those that have helped them out and be a part of a public art project. Chelsea Daniels reports. Scape Public Art and the All Right campaign invite all Cantabrians to join in celebrating local legends by urging people to share their stories with the hashtag that time you helped. What we are asking Christchurch people to do is to upload an image and a kind story of somebody who's helped them and we want to make this collective archive which is really telling the pulse of Christchurch and Christchurch people's attitudes. We're working with the All Right campaign so it's about mental health and I think if you do a kind thing you feel good and if you tell somebody about doing a doing something kind, you feel better. <laughs> Among the nominees is Steve and Emma Cliff, a couple who met their nominator at a cafe. So I had a bad experience um, with a building company and I was I met Steve and Emma down at a cafe one day. Well, I'd met them a few times, but one day I got chatting and I was telling them about my bad experience and how I'd kind of run out of money to finish my house. And, um, yeah, and I mentioned that I didn't have a fence, my dog was getting out. Um, and anyway, then I got a message on Facebook when I was going home saying we'd love to do your fence for you um, and help you out. The next day, Steve got to work, and just over a week later, she had a new fence and a new deck. It had taken, the, the build took about 17 months and a lot of stress, and yeah, I was just short of funds, I couldn't really finish the job, and um, yeah, Emma and Steve just wanted to help me out, and yeah, it did an amazing deck, an amazing fence, and yeah, it's just fantastic. And when she heard about Scape's That Time You Helped project, she couldn't think of anyone better to nominate. I really wanted to get it out there, you know, a positive story, because you hear so many negative stories about builders, and, and I wanted to put out that, you know, there's some really great people out there that, you know, want to help you out out of the kindness of their hearts. Steve's helped out in home repairs since the quakes wherever he can, and jumped at the opportunity to help someone out. It was just opportunist, really, that it kind of happened that way. Um, but yeah, so it was sort of something we'd always planned on doing, and then just, yeah, it popped up, and it was quite a good thing to do. And, and we knew, being in the trade, we knew the story about the builders that had gone bust and, and left people in the lurch and stuff, so we thought, oh, good opportunity to try and help someone out. And he's keen to help out again in the future. We'll continue to try and do this as, you know, um, in years to come stuff as well. But it is a nice thing to do, trying to help people out, um, especially the way things are in Christchurch. He says he was slightly embarrassed about the nomination and wasn't planning on gaining any recognition for this kind gesture. I, you know, we never did it for anything other than helping someone out. Like it's, um, yeah, it was just a, a nice thing to do. And we, you know, we haven't told really anyone what we've done and stuff like that. So, um, but yeah, no, it's, it's really nice that she's done that and nominated us for it. Entries for the campaign end on November 15th, with Scape encouraging Cantabs to post photos and their stories, which will become a part of the public assisted wall in the Restart Mall. So we really encourage people to get out there with their phones, take a photograph of somebody who's helped them and post it um, so that we can see all of the kind gestures of Christchurch people at this time after the, um, all of the earthquakes and how we've changed as a community. There have been hundreds of entries for this work in just two weeks. Chelsea Daniels, CTV News.